Hello, everybody. How are you? Welcome to Light Grid. Uh, light Grid. Off Grid uh, Light Worker, guys. I got to get used to this saying it. Um, I really like the new name. It really does resonate more with me more. Um, but if you are here, you are here to find out what a Scorp is up to doing. Think it's saying and feeling, guys. Let's take what resonates. Let's leave what doesn't, okay? If it's your story, let's own it. Get through it. Forgive ourselves the person. If it's not yours, let's Scorp carry that, okay? It's not for you to carry. Don't do it. Anyways, let's go find out what Scorpio is up to doing, thinking, and feeling. Please like and subscribe, guys. I'm liking my little channel over here now. Let's go. Led by God. Guided by you. What is in Scorpio's energy for the collective? What is in Scorpio's energy for the collective? What is going on? Just had a full moon and air, new moon in Aries. The wild, wild Pluto went into Aquarius, huh? Led by God. Guided by you. But if we are aware we know how to navigate these things right last one out thank you what is scorpio what is our scorpions up to out there let's go i got a little head cold so excuse me if i sniff in. i don't know if it's a cold. i'm not one for allergies but when there's this much wind which guys is my least favorite um element whatever of the world is wind i don't know I feel like it's a little head cold, or it could just be some allergies, which I don't have, but like I said, when it's consistent like this, and it's cold. All right, they're making a selfish decision. This come up twice today with other ones. Trust your loved ones. Uh, they're going to start a new relationship. Guys, they may be making a selfish decision. Uh, decision? Decision? To start something new with somebody. They're probably talking to their friends and family about it. It's probably pretty intense. Um, maybe they've gotten out of something and they're needing to trust somebody. I don't know what the selfish decision would be. But um, looks like they're going to start some new relationship here. But damn, they really love themselves. This is the first time I've really been drawn to this picture. Look how they, she's like kissing herself. Okay. I don't know why I was drawn to that. <laughs> Maybe this Scorp is really into themselves. I don't know. Let's go. Which I've ever met very few Scorps that are insecure, but when I've met them, I've met them. <laughs> yep, completing something out after uh, healing from something. Let's go. Love by God, guided by you, Spirit. Let's go. Maybe, you know, they feel it's too soon to start something new or maybe they're starting a new job and they feel that it's selfish for them to leave their old But I don't know. It's going to take as it resonates to you. It could be friends. It could be family. I always say it could be the grocery store clerk, the mechanic. I don't know. It's how it's resonating with you. And look at, they just showed up. Okay, let's go. And by God, guided by you. Thank you. Last one out, guys. I love these cards, but they're getting a little banged up, huh? <laughs> I notice a few of them on the corners is just... Oh, well. I was using these a lot for my personal reads. Well, what the heck is going on here? But now I'm going to um, bring them back over here. They wanted to come back to the collective. <laughs> if that makes sense. I let my cards do what they want, where they feel best. They do end up having a personality of their own, I feel. Let's go. What's going on for Scorp? What's in Scorp's energy? What's in Scorp's energy? How do you want it? They're stressed out, guys. They have some anxiety. Someone might have been sneaky in their energies, or they may have their eye on somebody. I don't know. I, see how that guy, that kid's eye? They might have their eye on somebody that's stressing them out. I think they're watching, having their eyes on somebody as the devil shows up here, bottom of the deck. Might be a Capricorn involved. Oh, look, it was flipped too. With the star underneath. Wow. Okay, let's go. 
Why the Nine of Swords? Why the Nine of Swords? Why are they so... Oh, yep, a union. They're worried about a union. There's, they got their eye on somebody for a, what they feel is a divine union, okay? Stability. I mean, I've said it, it could be a, a halfway to marriage twin flame card, but it's a stability, it's a divine union, it's a high level union. And they're stressed out and they got their eye open. I never point this out in this card, but they got their eye open. I don't know why I'm being pointed at all these cards today, but let's just be pointed to, I'm pointed to pictures a lot, but I really bought a lot of new decks recently to point out something, find something new. So I guess the spirits is finding new things for me that I have missed. What is this union all about? Can we get the energies of this union of the person? Oh, it's about happiness for them. It makes them really happy. this decision and we're gonna go find out starting a new relationship this relationship's gonna make them happy why are they stressed out maybe the other person's not into them let's go I wanna find out what's going on here let's go let's I just caught my hair in that something that isn't completed with someone world in reverse. Something's not completed. Something's not closed out. So are they stressed because they want to close it out so they can start this new relationship? Okay. What's going on here, Spirit? Let's go. Yes, they got a lot of strife on their hands right now. Let's go. It's getting warm right now, too. Somebody that made them feel stable. Who's the King of Swords here? They're stuck. They're stuck though. They're stuck and maybe that's why they gotta make a selfish decision. Oof. There's some drama around them too. Too bad. That they wanna move away from. They're waiting for somebody or something though. I don't know what it is to balance out, yes. They felt wounded from it, or they feel wounded now. But they're emperor, well, they're boss. Who's this king of pentacles? Who's this king of pentacles? Is this Scorpio or the other person? I think the other person, they want clarity from the other person that they're stable in this, or that they can be stable in this. Oh. Okay, it's somebody that they've moved away from or moved away from them. A heart broke, a heart was broken here. There's lots of swords here, guys. It's a lot of thought in the squirt's head. But um, they got clarity and they moved away or somebody's moved away from them and it broke their heart. But yet this person, they find valuable and stable in their life. Four of Wands is a stability, stability relationship very solid four legs standing king of pentacles is very loyal dedicated but damn stable so this person brought a lot of happiness and stability to them um, financially uh, emotionally energetically and it made them happy but somebody's moved away from this and somebody's heart was broke their heart got broken okay but they found some confidence in themselves Oh, they got their intuition going, too, and some patience going on. Oh, God. As they're waiting for this king of wands. Now, they don't need to go out and be all impulsive, okay? I'm not seeing a third party here, so... I don't know what the selfish decision would make. B. Maybe people don't want this to happen. Maybe a friend is involved. I don't know. Where is this a third party situation? Is this a third party situation? Let's go for Scorp. Is this a third party situation? That's a lot. It's Dustin. 
There might be a few people involved that are fighting destiny. That's why they're stressed out and watching. Something that makes them happy in their life is incomplete. They have clarity on that. It broke their heart. I'm gonna ask if there's a third party. I feel there's more multiple people here. See them all down there lined up. Fighting destiny for this score. Left out of the end. There you go. They're not going to be left out in their cold anymore or keep to themselves. Hell no, they're going to go get justice. Look at five of pentacles in reverse, four of pentacles in reverse, and justice. Yes, because they don't want this drama in their head. I don't blame them. And then there's the queen of wands showing up. Look, the, look at this. Like, legit, look at this. All the queens are in a row. So there's, there is a third party involved here. It's very feminine um, driven. I got the queen of swords. I got the queen of wands. And I got the queen of cups here. So, yes. Okay, but that queen of wands that is upright. They're standing confident and proud. The other two are in reverse. So, who's ever not for it, maybe getting... Um, so buy then, because like this is what I want. So I'm I've been told to split this deck. I knew there was multiple people and for three queens to show up. And it was it's very feminine based anyway, so I keep seeing the three of pentacles. Yep, there is a this is three party. A third party doesn't have to be like um relationship, another uh mistress or something. It, it could just be energies it could be people it could be your job it could be money it could be whatever but destiny's being fought here and i don't think it's necessarily them they're fighting it because i feel they're needing to trust some people around them yeah to create this to birth this to become the empress to get, put the world in her hands by not fighting destiny whoever wants to fight this scorps destiny should not be because it's not their destiny. It's Scorps and Scorps got to live with themselves. <laughs> Judgment. Yep, there we go. Hangman getting a different perspective uh, about a hair front six of cup situation, guys. It's Queen of Wands. <laughs> I love it. Priestess temperance. I'm telling you, they're having a lot of patience right now. They're really in wondering, what do I do? Judgment. Hangman. Hierophant. Getting the perspective, making a different call or a judgment call on this about a past soul bond. Wanting to offer some new passion and creativity to the dynamic okay to come into romance and give you and realizing they need to stop this fighting destiny if they want to be the empress okay and if they want an empress in their life and the emperor guys they are i keep getting this at the bottom of my deck as well temperance this is so divine and this is what it is divine union my cards out here <laughs> Sorry, guys. Like I said, I have a little chest cold. Um, Will of Fortune is divine and temperance is divine. The biggest divine union cards and patient and this union uh, divine period and timing is out here. So whoever wants to fight this, they need to trust their loved ones and go in and tell them how they feel and uh, hope and trust that they won't fight this on them anymore because it makes them happy. It makes it feel stable. It broke their heart when they moved away from it or they got moved away from. I'm going to go into these cards. What does Scorp have to say here? What does Scorp have to say? Let by God, guided by you, Spirit. 
I know this tape is crazy. I could have went in there, but I worked in here this morning, so I just didn't want to deal with moving everything around. Let's go. They scared themselves that day, whatever day that was. I did. I mixed two decks, so yes, I know. It's messy, but it's fine. It's my mess. I like my messes. I got to clean them up, not anything else, so. What have I got guided by you, Spirit? Let's go. Last one out. Thank you. What have I got guided by you, Spirit? I focused on you instead of my pain. Please forgive yourself. Do you need to forgive yourself? Scorp wants you to. You should. We're all not perfect, so if you've done something, you just own it, like I say, and eventually forgiveness comes in all areas, yourself, the situation, the people involved. Let's go. What's up for score? What do they got to say here in the shadows and the closure cards? I hope I will see you again sometime. I believe they want to see somebody again. It stresses them out that they're not. They got their eye on this person too. Please acknowledge me. I cannot come back. I need to focus on my healing. So right now, this, this girl can't come back. They need to focus on their healing. But yet, they want you to know that. By acknowledging them, then you would know that, hey, right now is not the time. But maybe, but don't wait for anybody. Waiting's ridiculous. It's not ridiculous. It just doesn't help you if they don't ever come back. Now you've put all this time off. What is meant for you will never pass you by. I like the way our grandparents thought because that's what they think. If you love somebody, they'll come back around. My grandma used to always tell me, both my grandmas. I know I made a mistake. Okay, so they know they made a mistake. Whatever that is. It scared them that day too, whatever the mistake was. One more out, one more out, one more. I want to tell you so much. Yeah, I, th I just think right now they can't do it. Guys are having to work through a lot of themselves. Some people involved. You know, they want you to, they want forgiveness in this. They want to forgive you. They want you to forgive yourself. They want to tell you so much. They know they've made a mistake. They want to be acknowledged. But they're focused on their healing and they shall be and they should be. And they want to see you again. So, this was not part of my plan. Thank you for leaving me. Wow. Okay. And then... I know you're watching me. I see them watching you, so maybe you're watching them too. All right? Well, clearly, you're here at Crosswatch or Heaven, which I always say, I don't know, I don't crosswatch much. And usually lately, I, re I watch Tarot not about love. I watch it about other things. But um, our friends, whatever, you're crosswatching. I feel they're watching you just as much as you are them. All right? fantasize about you. These things is falling all over now. This is stupid. Your body language says so much. All right. You guys be blessed. Be well. Please like, subscribe, share this with another Scorp or maybe somebody else is dating or hanging out or wanting to know what a Scorp up to. I would love my videos to start to be shared. All right. You got Leo here. You got the world, which is all the fixed signs, guys. You got Sag. You got Virg. You got a lot of different signs here. Okay. You be blessed, you be well, and uh, bye for now.